Some of the evidence for this, it's really critical. And some of it is hiding in plain sight right in front of our faces. After World War II, what was America worried about? Russia coming over the top. They launched Project Nanook. They sent Major Maynard E. White up to the Canadian Arctic. And then they started to dig down. It's very icy. You've got some polar fossils in there. And then they hit one of these disaster layers. And below that, it's tropical fossils. And then another disaster layer, polar. And then another disaster layer, tropical. It's where they said, here's what's happening. We get a magnetic pole shift, and the Earth tilts 90 degrees, putting the Arctic at the tropics. And that's why those tropical fossils are found there. They dug these perfectly frozen mammoths out of 20 or 30 feet of ice and snow. And what did they find? They had frozen so quickly, the food was undigested in their mouths and even their stomachs. What were they eating? What do you think was there in the glacial cycle? 50, 60 feet of ice? Certainly not the thousand pounds of vegetation that these things needed to eat every day. There's nothing to eat there now. In the glacial cycle, when it was 20 degrees colder, there was nothing to eat up there, I assure you. Unless that part of the world wasn't at the top unless it was down near mid latitudes or low latitudes, and then it got thrust to the polar region, which froze the mammoths pretty instantly. 